This is on trigonometry. Let's do this one. From the top of a tower, a sight sees an airplane at an angle of 30 degrees. A bird sees an airplane at an angle of 30 degrees. The bird sees the reflection of the plane on a river at an angle of depression of 60 degrees. The bird is sitting on top of a tower. It looks up and at 30 degrees it finds the plane. It looks down and at 30, 60 degrees it finds the reflection of the plane. The distance between the bird and the plane is 300 meters. Find the height at which the plane was flying above the ground level. Almost all of these heights and distances question, it's important to get the diagram right. So spend some time, get the diagram right. So this is tower BQ. The bird is sitting here. At a 30 degree angle of elevation, it finds the plane. Then this is the river here. At a 60 degree angle of depression, it finds the reflection. P is the plane. P dash is the reflection. The first thing we know is PR equals RP dash. Reflecting of a simple reflecting surface, the height above the river and the distance of the reflection below the river should be equal. So we need to find PR, this distance, this is what we need to find. Let's keep knocking off whatever we know. This is 30 degrees. The hypotenuse is 300. Fine. Sin 30 is PA by BP. Sin 30 is 1 by 2 that we know. BP is 300. PA by 300 is 1 by 2 or PA is 150. This is 150. This much we know. Okay. This distance is 150. We can find this. Tan 30 is 1 by root 3. This distance is 150 root 3. And so BA is 150 root 3. That much we know. Now, this triangle BAP dash tan 60 equals AP dash by BA or AP dash equals tan 30, sorry, tan 60 into BA or AP dash is root 3 into 150 root 3, which is 150 into 3, which is 450. PA is 150, AP dash is 450. This whole distance is 450. So PP dash, this distance is 600, sum of these two. Height at which the plane was flying above ground level is half of that or 300 meters. Wonderful question, but it's a very doable question once we get the idea right. Once we draw the diagram right, and the thing to keep in mind, whenever you have anything being reflected, there's a plane, there's a reflecting surface, there's a reflection. The height above the, the river that which the plane is flying, the exact same distance below the river, the reflection of the plane would be there. It's plain, plain and simple mirror reflection or river reflection. And we all know that. All we need to do is put that into a context and you're through. So the height at which the plane was flying above the river level is 300 meters.